So anyways, maybe you won't be celebrating this birthday, but then do you have any intention of actually gifting her something? Because we have teddy bears around, we have roses, we have and people are doing a whole lot of packages ranging from fifty cities to thousand and all that. Um, do you have any plans of gifting her some of these packages? Teddy bear no. Roses no. Allergic she's allergic to teddy. <laughs> She's allergic to tell you that all no, this, uh, this thing. No. What about money? Money. Money can't put it on Pesica. What does she want then? She wants me. Hey. She wants me. Like, you see the way I find. Hello, lovely viewers. You are welcome to Mass Band TV. And this is our number one entertainment show. This is the Valentine edition of the love show. Guess what? This is a love show. We are going to bring you a lot of these love stories in which people are actually experiencing. Guess what? We will be bringing up topics that will be sliced with panels. So stay tuned and watch Mass Band TV. I'm Mildred, and as we are launching this love show today, we are going with the Vows Day edition. So, I have here with me an important personality. He is a photographer, a videographer, a movie producer, and many more. I can't name it. He's called Bullets. He said he's called Quick Bullets. So, <laughs> Bullets. Yeah. Um, you good? Yeah, I'm fine. Fine. Yeah. And I hope you are ready. Yeah, I'm ready. I'm okay. Ready. Yeah. So lovely viewers, Bullet says he's ready. So our topic for today is actually um creative ideas for couples on this Vows Day. What do you think couples are supposed to do to keep each other in this month of love, which is February? Well, Bullet is here to slide with us this topic. So let's say the ball rolling. Okay, so, Bullet, uh, yeah. have you ever been in a relationship before? As in love relationship? Yeah, of course. <laughs> I've been in so many relationships. Oh, yeah. well, yeah, so. and are you still in one? Yes, I'm in one. I'm in one, and I'm actually enjoying it. Oh, <laughs> that's so lovely. Yeah. You're really so, enjoying it. Because of my relationship, I had to, you know, dress like this because, you know. Oh, you are When I was good. coming, she dressed me too. Wow, you are looking good, by the way. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> okay, yeah. so um, we all can see that Wules is very interested. So that's the reason why I actually invited him to be on this show. So um, let's get started. Sure. You said you are already in a relationship. Perfect one. Perfect one? Yes. That will be leading to marriage, right? Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> the obviously wasn't sounding so well. Anyways, um, so uh, Bullet, I would like to ask you, since uh, in your previous relationship, okay, did you ever enjoy Val's Day? Did you ever give your loved one something because it was so precious? Like, I just want to know about it. Well, <clears throat> for my past relationship, I've uh, not gifted any of my loved ones. Yes, it's a fact because um, I we're young and to be frank, yeah, we're actually young. So that kind of thing wasn't we were we weren't even seeing each other all the time. So the vows they there, Mindy, be that to be frank. <laughs> Was it a long distance relationship? Not really long, but you hardly see. Yes, you had see them. So we'd be it's just. Normally, phone calls, we will friend or then. But at least you could have sent Momo, because Momo. Or you had no intention of actually gifting them. Yes. Any you know, of them. Yeah. And were they cool? They were. They were cool. Yes, they were cool. You know, all my girlfriends and my. All, all of them, they are cool. You know, they are not sicker, precious, and sicker, <laughs> people. <laughs> 
<laughs> yes, you know some people they really love money. Girls yes. really love money. Yes. Oh, that but then I said, girl, you can't just me, bro, to get it. At least you are supposed to get money. Yeah, sure. But all my loved ones, my girlfriends, they all they always, you know, like the way um I entertain them. Not about my money. As for the money, there some day okay. they see the way I shot. This <laughs> this suit I bought it worth uh, twenty thousand dollars. Yes, <laughs> I I yes yes. Oh. So as you can see, the money there some day, but the gifts in there. Okay. Not 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 because I'm just so, but I don't really like gifts. When you are closer to me, you and Kasa, you see how really good are. and interesting I am. So, yeah. In the long run, you are trying to say that you don't really enjoyed any vows day. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Oh, so do, um, how do you see people who actually celebrate this vows day? Do you see them as like these people they are not serious, like this and that? Like how do you see them? Um not they are not serious, like everyone has a way of living. You get it. Some people um go out for, you know, uh, uh, on vows day. You know, to I mean, keep yourself in the good shape. But me, I have busy schedules all the time, so you it's hardly you get me at those um, places. Yeah, I have busy schedules all the time, so it's not as if uh, they are not. No, yeah. Okay. I think I get it. I get it. In yes. Way. So um, basically, you're trying to say that. Um, if others are celebrating vows, it doesn't necessarily mean that you're also supposed to celebrate. Yes, obviously. You don't really, really see the need in it. No. And you don't have time. For I it. don't have time. Yes, but I don't have time. you have time. time for love, right? Yes. You know, as for calls and video calls and all that, we do it. But yes, yes. You know, I can be working. You know, my work is... Being a photographer, when you're editing, you can't you can just place your phone in front of you and then you'll be, you know, still making your call whilst you're editing. Uh, yes. It's only hard you, when you're taking a shoot or when you're doing a, a, a studio session that you can't actually talk or on phone or something. But apart from that, you can do in it when you are editing, when you're doing it, you can just call whoever you want to call and then do your dosan. Yes. <laughs> Um, okay, but do you know something? You see, um, we the ladies, we actually love pampering. Sure. We actually like it and love it when our men pamper us. But since you are saying um, you don't really, really see the need like to celebrate vows day, um, will you be okay if your girlfriend goes out with someone on vows day? Of course not. <laughs> Why do you go on board? <laughs> No, 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 no. Vows are for lovers. Two lovers, right? Not necessarily love. Are you sure? You see, um, February itself is um, a month of love, right? Of course. So, on the vows, you can actually show love to your friends and other people, but not necessarily your loved one. Oh, okay. So, but then, you can actually go out with your families, but not a guy. I mean, vows are baby of you. Time for that, but you celebrate it in the house. If I'm in the house of vows, they fine. Maybe we can schedule something and do. But then, if a busy day falls on the vows day, I can't make it. Really? Yes, you, since it's a vows day, you can be there and someone will actually call you. I'm having a party here. I need a photographer. I'm doing this. And this. Okay. Yeah, so all those kinds of things. Yeah. So, being a photographer with some events, it's hard. Oh. You get it. But sometimes you can just schedule up some things and then plan a day together and then you just do it. Yeah. Okay. So from what you just said, um, does it mean that um, in as much as you can't really make it, you can't make, um, you can't go out on a date with your girlfriend, you can, in a normal day, you can actually schedule a yes. date. Yes. Yes. That one. Yes. As for that one day, I can because... It's though I'm, I'm a busy type, but I don't think all days I'm busy. Okay. Yes, so maybe one of these days when she calls for it, that maybe today the Charlie, I know they feel the environment around. Yeah, we could <laughs> enter the party inside and go feel something. So, and yeah, yeah, we could go create something, then you know. So, okay, yeah, <laughs> but I think that um, you should try as much as possible to at least celebrate one of the vows with your girlfriend because. 
girls love pampering. So anyways, maybe you won't be celebrating this birthday, but then do you have any intention of actually gifting her something? Because we have teddy bears around, we have roses, we have and people are doing a whole lot of packages ranging from fifty cities to thousand and all that. Um, do you have any plans of gifting her some of these packages? Teddy bear no. Rose is no. Allergic. She's allergic to te <laughs> She's allergic to teddy bear and all this uh, this thing. No. What about money? Money. Money can't put the on Pesica. What does she want then? She wants me. Hey. She wants me. Like, you see the way I find. She <laughs> wants only me. Not money, not teddy bear, not <laughs> roses. Yes. She like, wants me. Real. Yes, she wants so me. So, in a year, how, how many times do you get her? Do you give her on her birthday? No. So, how is she? She can also gift me. Oh, that one is there. And you are the one here, and you are the one that I need answers from. So basically, you're supposed to tell me what you do that makes her happy. Because in every relationship, mm -hmm. you are you are a businessman, yeah. if I should say. And since you are in your since you are in a relationship with someone, at least sometimes you have to be gifting yeah. uh, one or two stars just to keep the relationship. relationship yeah. get. So if you are saying you don't gift it, I don't really get it. Are you really in a relationship, or do you think that? Uh, she doesn't care because sometimes ladies feel like, hey, my, my man is not gifting me anything. Doesn't mean he's cheating on me. Doesn't mean I don't deserve it. So why? Why? So um actually I want to answer with a question. Is gifting uh, mandatory in every relationship, like you gifting your girlfriend mandatory in every relationship? Okay, so personally, I don't think it's mandatory. Okay. But then, like, sometimes you should just give your partner something. It's not like they are supposed to be expensive. Okay. But then something even affordable you think your partner may like can just purchase and give it to him or her. You get it? Okay. Yeah, it's not, it's not a bad idea at all. Because sometimes when someone gives you something, you feel yeah. pampered, you feel pressure, you feel important. So... I think it's actually not mandatory, but then it's a must. It's a must. In the relationship, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, I'll start gifting. <laughs> yeah. I'll start gifting. <laughs> like, I'll, I'll be checking up. Sure, you. I'll start gifting. Don't worry. Uh, from, from 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 uh, starting from today. Today is Val's day, mm -hmm. so I'll, I'll start from today. Yeah, as 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 I'm speaking, let me just give her something. You just hey, she, she just received <laughs> something right now. So let me start gifting. Okay. So I'm gifting right now. As you can so see, I'm gifting right now. Momo. Yeah, Momo. Momo money. Yes. Okay. I'm sending her twenty five thousand. Hey. Okay. <laughs> yes, Momo. <laughs> no, um, actually, she's not. She's not around. So, Momo will do. Momo will yeah, do. Momo. Okay. Oh, you are in a long distance relationship. Very, very long. Like, very long. But in Ghana, she's in Ghana. Yeah, very long. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, I think I have here with me some messages from friends. Okay. Or other people actually sharing their ideas on what couples must give each other. So, um, first of all, this one said, <laughs> sorry. This one said, a red teddy bear. That's from uh, Milk. <laughs> a red teddy bear. I was like, yeah, teddy bear. <laughs> Have you ever received a teddy bear? Me, no. So um, this person also says, um, um, she will actually get him maybe a sneaker and a perfume. So eh, a sneaker and a perfume. Wow. Some ladies are very rich. Me, she should not do. So uh, this person also says, um, watch, wristwatch and sneakers. Or maybe hamper. That's what the person said. So this one was from a male. Yes. Hamper. Hamper as in food hamper. See those kind of baskets that have a breakfast or lunch and those things. I was like, oh, okay. Okay. So the next one says, uh, because ladies love material stuff. And actually it's true. Aside, man, ladies really love material stuff. So he said that um, 
dress, maybe a very nice dress, perfume, um, roses, and maybe a date. So um, basically, the nice dress will be worn for the date. You get it. Uh -huh. So this is what he actually said. And someone also said photo portrait. I've never received photo portrait before, but people are suggesting it would be one of the best gifts. Anyways, if you want to give me something, you can give to me a photo portrait. I would really appreciate <laughs> so, so this one said um shirt. Hmm, shirt. I think it is it's better. So far, the messages I have here, none of them said boxes because Many men have been complaining that uh, ladies like into the boxes. And is it really true? For me, I don't really think it's true, bro. But you need boxer, you need boxer shorts. So, <laughs> but nobody actually said it because uh, men had been saying that it's too much or it needs to be doing that and all. So this also said um, chocolate, gifting the girl a chocolate. Girls love chocolate. Me, like I really love chocolate. So if you are gifting something, chocolate must be part. Get a man. Yeah. Without money, chocolate. I like chocolate. So, yeah, so if you are my girlfriend right now, I don't add money, just chocolate. I'm okay as well. So, are you sure? Yeah. Be my girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I can't control my laughter. Anyways, um, this one also said um, a date night. But within your budget, you shouldn't exceed your budget. So basically, some people think that um, if you are to go on a date with your fiance or your girlfriend or your boyfriend, you need to pay some of money. But then, you don't really need that high amount of money. You can actually go on a date with just 100 to 200. So you can go to the beach with just one or two drinks and you're okay. So they just necessarily mean that you have to get maybe thousands to be thousand or something so you can actually get a mini date with a very low budget last last some years that we all want to get it then someone also said wristwatch sneaker people have been saying with wristwatch sneaker wristwatch sneaker i think it's cool because none of them actually mentioned boxer shorts of which um this thing has been um something that the males have been dragging that females like it boxes much water or so no. right now they're not saying like what's that short it's fine right now we are all changing right now we are all saying wristwatch sneaker wristwatch sneaker so i think these are just things i've seen on the ideas of how to give your partner something you get it so you can actually gift them any of these or if you have money like if you are trusted you can actually buy very very expensive stuff in as much as people have suggested that you can buy this stuff, like this stuff are cool, like for 50 cents for you, you can actually get any of this to your party. But me, I don't have money, like she should sh get it. <laughs> yeah, so that was that. So these are some of the messages I received from friends and other people. Uh, teddy on, bear. Yeah, teddy bear. Teddy but, bear. Yes, most ladies like it. Yeah, I've never received teddy bear, but if someone should give me a wallet, why not? Teddy bear. Mm. Why are you a kid? Uh -uh. No, why 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 would a girl choose to sleep with a teddy bear rather than a man? Oh, but you see, uh -huh, as you are saying, where, where can you go with a teddy bear? See, as no, where you can say, you go? As you are, anywhere at all. You can be holding teddy bear <laughs> on the street. Oh, yes, yeah, no. But you know something? Mm -hmm. Um like you just said that your girlfriend, you are in a long distance relationship. Very right? long, like from uh -huh. here to so, Temali. You can give your girlfriend a teddy bear and she will just be sleeping with you because you just said that um instead of sleeping with your man, you sleep with a teddy bear. But then teddy bear, that would be the only available thing for your girlfriend to actually sleep with. So but some people actually love them. And because of how some people are trained and all they always sleep from hand and so if, of course. Yeah, teddy bear is but teddy like, bear is not God is your companion. <laughs> God is your 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 number one companion. I mean, you know, people too don't like teddy bear. Okay. Yes, people see teddy bear as kaka moto. Yeah. How? <laughs> yes, people see kaka the teddy bear. They are they are afraid. Yes. Really? Yes. Me like this, I fear teddy bear a lot. Oh. Yeah. If I see teddy bear, I will run. Yes. Because 
it looks like horror, be zombie. Be. I don't know. There is this horror movie, be way then take teddy bear actor. I don't watch horror movies. Ah, uh, then you have, you have to go and watch it. I forgot the like the title, like me 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 metro. Yeah. So oh, teddy, teddy bear need there, Charlie. No. Out of my line. Really. But money yeah. bouquet. I didn't hear someone saying money bouquet. Yes. Nobody yes. Said it. So uh, that is what I'm going to do right now. Oh money bouquet. Yes. So um, actually. Well, let's also suggesting something. Said yeah, money. money yes. yes. So, so you can it will be hundred dollars. Hundred dollars, sir. That that would be for yours. Yes, hundred dollars, sir. So, what if someone also wants to gift the girlfriend the money to pay, but doesn't have that amount of money? What do you suggest the person should maybe the person should just put it in an envelope or just send it as Momo? Yes, Momo will do or envelope will do. Yes. If you don't have it, don't. If, <laughs> if you don't have it, don't try. The thing is, 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 is a very big truth. If you don't have the money, don't try. Because we, the people that we have the money, self, hey. when we are doing it, <laughs> when we are doing it, we, 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 you know, like, we, we put budgets on it. You get me? Okay. Yeah, we put budgets on it. So when you, you don't, one thing, yeah, man, try. Okay. Yes. When you are eating food and you don't see this food, it will harm your stomach. Don't try it. Yes. <laughs> Prevention is better than, than yes. Okay, so in our bullet is trying to say that um, if you don't have the money, don't stress yourself. Yes. Because it's not really mandatory for you to give someone something. Yeah. Even as much as the person is your loved one, you can still be in a relationship and gift her or him in a different way. So if you don't have the money at the moment, just don't stress yourself. Your love matters. Yeah. Hope that's what you wanted yes. to say. Yes. You know, um, one thing you left out when you were mentioning my name, you know, I am, I'm a counselor as well. Oh. Yes. I'm a, I'm a marriage counselor. I've counseled one a or two. marriage counselor? Yes. I've counseled one or two. Married? Yeah, I'm not married, but you can see me. <laughs> yeah. I'm a marriage counselor. I've counseled one or two, and so now they keep thanking me. Oh. Okay. Yes. Uh, I look very young, but, you know. Yeah, the brains are yeah. large. So, you know, everything in this world has to do with communication yeah everything in this one has to do with communication so when you guys understand yourself when you understand you you always create an open communication between both angles i mean everything will go smoothly if you understand the fact that i work i don't really have enough money on me i work but i really don't have enough money on me definitely you should know that one day will be a boom for me so when the two of you understand that something's more something's more for me at least vast day you wouldn't stress me that uh, my babe didn't get something for me so i'm actually angry and then um you you are actually comparing your friend's relationship to you i mean that won't do yes that won't do so every love matters has to do with communication and then um, understanding communication and understanding because if i understand you understand me the angles that both of us are coming from i mean everything goes on well okay yeah so basically um let's try to say that in every relationship what matters is communication effective communication very effective yeah i think i said because you can't be in a relationship without actually understanding each other yeah. And as you actually said, don't compare yourself to your friends. You can separate a um, relationship, so you don't know what's actually going on there. So if let's say your friend your friends or your friend receives um big packages and you don't receive anything, you are the one that is disappointed and you don't get it. If your boss or your fiance knows that he has money, why not buy it for you? Buy something for you that he does not have. Don't stress yourself and Obviously, obviously. Oh, okay, so um, as you, you mentioned earlier that you gave your girlfriend a bouquet yeah. of money. Yes. Oh, so, so she she uh-huh. should expect it. She should expect it. Yes. What's her name? Her name. <laughs> her name is sealed on my mouth. <laughs> oh, okay. So you mean like you mentioned her name? No. no. Well, that's fine. You are not supposed to put into your personal affairs. Yeah. 
Maybe yeah. someone is crashing on me right now. <laughs> I know, right? If you are crashing, you can. I can give you my number right oh, now so that you start calling. You are in a relationship already. Are you sure? Can I hear? You have to be in more than two relationships. Eh, please, I beg you. Yeah, this one, let's end it here. <laughs> you are not going further. <laughs> you are not going further. So, um, basically, I think um, it's actually giving creative ideas on how to um, spend your vows day with your partner. Yeah, picnic. And, yes. Yeah. And even without much money, you can still do something. something. And At least KFC in America here and the market, <laughs> how much is it? Don't be, don't be too chiso. Let me advise them. They shouldn't be too chiso. KFC Nam, how much is it? Is it expensive? Eh, uh-huh. eh, uh, uh, moving pick, Ahoko Nam, how much is it? Take her there. Make she feel free. But me, dear, I'm not part. I'm not part. She understands it. That I won't do it. But as for you watching me, the one watching me right now, no, now I'm make a trend and say, take your girl. KFC bucket is. But do you know, um, can't force them to actually take them to because you yourself you even mentioned that um, you wouldn't give your girlfriend anything but later on you right now they are going to send bouquet uh uh-huh, so money bouquet yeah so um then if the person can't afford here it's actually chocolate so you shouldn't chocolate say, yes chocolate is how so much three six fifty percent because yes to some people it's quite expensive but chocolate you can get some for like ten cities ten cities really Yes. The last time I tried was three cities. Well, right now we have different types of chocolate. I'm talking about um, other the brands. The oh, okay, the okay. Brand. Me, I even thought the small one be we. The small ones are even big. Yeah. You can even buy them. Twenty percent or so. <laughs> <laughs> but then, but then, at least you should place value on your partner. Like if this because you can't just buy fifty percent. <laughs> Chocolate for your part? No, how? Like how? She has to understand. It's part the of the value. work. Value? No, at least the value. It's part. It's, it's, it's all part. Behind, you know? I mean, so if you are my girlfriend right now and I bring you twenty pesos. Oh no! If I, I don't take no, it. No, no, come, come on. If I don't tell you it's twenty pesos, would you know? Oh yes, definitely. Because girls love chocolate, and besides, like you know the price. And you know something. I will prepare the chocolate in my house. How? Oh you me. Know the procedures. Me. You see me like this. <laughs> I cook. I do everything. Yeah. That's why I'm the youngest CEO. I have about okay. fifty thousand companies in Ghana. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not talking much. Okay, so um, basically, um, these are some of the ideas on how to actually make your partner happy. You don't necessarily need much amount. And even if you are in a long distance relationship, maybe on that particular day of love, you can actually call on video call or maybe normal call. Yeah. Just do something like send something, send maybe something. time or money. So if you don't really have for now, maybe you are struggling or maybe you are trying to do something like something is very, very important in your life and you might not get the chance to actually do something. Just show some love. Yeah. Just show something. Then you see this something. is okay. Oh. And and mind you, um, Vows Day is not the only day that you can give your partner something. Just that it's a it's a day that we actually show love. Any other day you can actually give your partner. Any other day. Any other day. It's not mandatory to give only on Vows Day. I mean the bad days there. You have a star. You have any normal day that you can actually do gifted. So if you don't have now, just let your partner understand that this is a situation. Maybe next month or next two months, or when I get money, I'll actually do something better for you. And yeah, to keep the relationship going. It actually depends. Some girls are very envious and jealous. Yeah. So if you see their friends actually receiving packages and all that, then they become very jealous. Yes. Like, oh, yes. She didn't be jealous, my sister. <coughs> Just a flowers day package or gift, get it. So, I think um, we are almost at the end of the show, and I am Mamis. You can also call me Mildred, as I mentioned earlier. And this is um, the love show on this channel. And I would like to thank uh, my co panel here, uh, Volex. Yeah. <laughs> thank you very much for coming. You're welcome. And once again, I will say you look good. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs>
and I'll be expecting a video on how you surprise your girlfriend with the bouquet of flowers. Don't worry. Oh no, not flowers, money. Money, money, yeah, money. Yeah. I'll, I'll $100. be expecting that. Hundred dollars. Yeah. Oh, okay. In Ghana to do this, this, I think how much? Yeah, thousand. Thousand five hundred. Thousand five hundred. Yeah. I think it's less. Oh. It's less. The last time I okay. I'll check. Okay, I'll check. but it's around thousand. Yes, so. thousand. Okay, it's yeah. it's not bad. It's actually very. It's good. worth it. It's worth, Ali, it's worth it. Yes, it's okay. worth. Ali, when she sees it, she'll be like, she's not, you know. Oh, okay, she'll be surprised that you're. She will. Okay, fine. Yeah. Well, um, thank you all very much for watching this episode, especially this Flowers Day session. Thank you so much, and do all subscribe to this channel. Do all to like. Do all to share because there are more amazing content on relationship talks and tips coming up for you all. Thanks for watching.